Hi, in this video, I want to show you how you can easily create a landing page using your already existing Squarespace website without paying any extra money for third party um, platforms. But first, I just want to show you a few examples of a landing page. Um, so this one is from the convert kit, but um, so usually the landing page would not have uh, any header or footer, it would state the problem, it would give a solution, and it would uh, include a quick call to action, like register today, sign up, and things like that. It also might include um, some benefits, like what will you learn? Um, here's another example from the lead pages. Again, it's um, it provides the problem. People don't know how to attract the audience, and giving them a solution that uh, here you can download this free checklist and I'm going to show you how you can design your personal brand to attract your dream audience. And here below, it gives also a few more benefits of what you will learn inside this training. And again, it's um, give you an ability to download. So this is could be easily recreated inside the Squarespace, just using basic layouts. The only thing that you would have to do is just remove the header and the footer. This is exactly what I'm going to show you right here. So when you logged in um, on the back end of your website, you would navigate to pages and you would create a page just um, as you'd create any other page. In my case, I created this um, page called your landing page. Um, so it's a free checklist to create, um, you know, create a free landing page that converts. So the only thing that is missing on this landing page is a sign up button. So um, for this tutorial, I'm going to be using ConvertKit because this is the email uh, subscriber I'm using for my business. But uh, it's basically the same step for any other, uh, maybe you're using Flowdesk or MailChimp or wherever is out there would be very similar. So I would go to convert kit, log in on a back end and um, create a new form. I already have created a form. So just like a simple form. <clears throat> and you would you would need uh, to have the code. For this one, I'm going to copy the HTML code and go back to my website, I would need to add a code block and and put it right here. So I have for the mode, I have HTML um, display um, sources off and I just input whatever I copied from the convert kit and press save. As you can see, now I have the sign up button. So if people would like this free checklist, they would um, be able to grab it from this page. So the next thing uh, you would have to remove uh, the header and the footer. And this is literally two lines of code. It's super simple. I'm going to show you two ways um, in which you can um, achieve that. So first you would uh, hover over the link uh, of the page that you have created, then go to the gear icon press on it and go to advance and here this feature is available for plants that is business and higher up in squarespace and as any code injections are um, so you just input style header and footer and display none I'm gonna copy this. and click save and here we're going back to our page and as you can see the header and the footer are gone so that was one way uh, in which you can achieve it. Um, I'm just going to remove this and save. Uh, the next one would be to go to design, um, go to custom code. Uh, you don't need the style tag over here. Just press, press header, footer, display none and click save. But once, uh, if you, just done it like that. If you come back to the pages and let's go to the home page, it has um, the header and the footer has been removed from the entire website because um, wherever you input into the design, 
icon for the custom CSS, it applies to the whole website. So there is a way we can, um, okay, let's go to pages and back to the landing page so I can see it and then go to design and a custom CSS. So I'm gonna link um, this Squarespace ID finder. It's a free um, Google extension you can download. I already have it downloaded here. So all I have to do is click on it and any yellow color, there's going to be a collection ID number. And basically each new page that you create in Squarespace is going to have its unique collection ID number that you can use to um, scope your code just for this particular page. So just click on it and it's, as you can see, it's copied. What you have to do now is click here, open the brackets, copy it and insert here click save and if you click back on this um id finder it will disappear so as you as you can see the landing page is ready right now um you can already drive traffic to it and if we go back to the pages like to the home page we have uh, the header and the footer and it was not our code that we injected and the design was not affecting any other pages, but the one that we specified was the ID. Uh, yeah, so this is two ways you can uh, create landing pages um, in Squarespace. I hope it was useful. Thank you.